I'm here yeah. to show you my very simple, budget friendly home decor for fall. Everything that I purchased is from the Dollar Tree, and then I have one of you. Ooh. I have maybe one or two pieces from other places, but for the most part, everything's from the dollar store. I wanted to keep it very simple this year because, well, financially I just couldn't go all out. So, with all that being said, I hope these ideas help. Let's get started. You first walk in on my door, you see a welcome sign with a scarecrow from the Dollar Tree baby, as well as the garland, and we have this. Happy Harvest plaque. I don't know if you can see it well. Oh, there we go. So here is my door. Here's just a simple way to bring some fall into your home. And like I said, all these three pieces were from the Dollar Tree, so three bucks. Over to the left, I just have this little side table here with my children. And this is also like some disinfectant stuff for, you know, uh, obvious reasons but right here we have this little pumpkin plaque gather with grateful hearts moving on to the living room which is pretty simple I just have these two pictures that I already had and what I did was I added this little scarecrow it says welcome yet again and this was from the Dollar Tree now eventually I do want to upgrade and get a huge mirror but that's not right now so now we're moving on you can see my my toddler left <laughs> her cup right here but um we go down to this little side table, or I wouldn't even know what you call it, like a little nightstand, I guess you can say. And we have the Happy Harvest plaque from Dollar Tree, as well as a little pumpkin. And then I just put it in with all of the uh, pictures that I have with me and my husband. We have a side table here near the couch. And this is probably one of my favorite places in the house. But I did put this garland around it, and I think it adds so much character. And then below, we have the Hello Fall plaque, and then a pumpkin also from the Dollar Tree. And then you move on here. This picture I actually had for a while for my grandma, and what I did was I just put a garland over it. Yet again, Dollar Tree. And then going down here, I have a mixture of all these fall plants that I got from Dollar Tree too. So we have some maple, some sunflowers, just an assortment of all different colors of fall, and I love it so much. It adds so much character. And then I also put this little, little pumpkin here that I actually had since last year. So moving on to my little table. I did add this little tablecloth because I thought it added a sense of character. This was actually from Family Dollar. On it, it has sweater weather, it has snuggle weather and snuggle season and a box. It also has a little um, squirrel with a little scarf and I just love it so much. They have so many different ones at Family Dollar so check out Family Dollar. It was only four bucks so I thought that was a good deal. And then above we have this hello fall sign that I put there. And then we do have this pumpkin. This was probably the most expensive fall buy. But even so, it was $7, so not much at Yankee Candle. And it's a cookie jar. I have yet to put anything in it though. And then this is my favorite part of the house. This is the part that everybody loves. I have my fireplace. And then we have the scarecrow in front, which is from a store called Uncle Bucks. It's like a dollar store. Three dollars, y'all. I put the garland here. Eventually, I may put some lights, some orange lights, but we'll see. And I do have this little Dollar Tree sign that's nowhere near fall, but it does show the date, which I like. You, you can change it. <laughs> okay, so going on to the kitchen, well, there's not really much in the kitchen, but I will say I do have this hand soap. Three dollars from, I want to say Bell's Outlet. And I had that. I actually had that since last year. And then I always put stickers on my windows. The kids enjoy it so much. I have the fall leaves. I have pumpkins. This was from the dollar store as well. This farmer's market calendar, I actually decided to go ahead and um, take the pictures out and put them in some picture frames eventually. So that's why that's kind of just sitting there. But for now, this is my haul. So it wasn't much. I decided to just keep it very minimal and simple. I only decorated uh, the living room and a little bit of the kitchen. But as far as the rest of the apartment, I have yet to even reach that part yet. I don't even know if I'm going to decorate. But like this was kind of enough um, with the budget that I was going for. Very simple. So I hope you all enjoyed and got some ideas. And I'll see you in my next video. Mwah. Oh, also, sorry if you heard my children in the background. <sighs> you know how it is if you're a mom. See you guys next time. Bye.